BMC. Uh, tell us about uh, a specific project. Once again, you have the opportunity to look across the landscape here. Uh, why don't you highlight for us uh, a specific project that you all have been involved in uh, that has taken big data to sort of new heights, if you will? Yeah, so I mean, we, we do have an opportunity, um, again, as we're looking across the, both pro, uh, public and private sector, we, we do have an opportunity to get exposed to a lot of really, really cool things, a lot of which you guys and gals are hearing today from, from this crew. Um, here most recently, uh, we were working with, and by the way, this is a very common concept of a use case, but we've been working with um, certain manufacturers that make uh, really, really big vehicles um, on the planet, um, they have this opportunity to collect a tremendous amount of data um, from the vehicles that they have on the streets. Mm -hmm. um, and what they need to be able to do is collect that data from multiple sources, from thousands of trucks, um, so that they can start to predict when um, there is the potential for um, service that needs to be done on a truck. And oh, by the way, if there is service that requires certain parts, um, that those parts are proactively ordered and they're shipped to the service center so that that truck, when it arrives at the service center, it gets the work that it's done so it's back on the road. So for them, it's about keeping their fleet um, up, uh, keeping their fleet on the road, um, and this is something that they really, really struggled to do very early. Again, you're hearing some of it here, the, the, the orchestration of collecting all of that data, ingesting it, moving it from source to source, and actually getting some actionable insights that they could proactively push on. That was something that they really, really struggled with. They were doing it with duct tape and bailing wire. Um, so they, they really needed to find a way to streamline that process and to do something that, that most agencies and organizations are struggling to do bring that to scale. Um, they're finding ways to, to, to put it together with tape, but when they want to actually roll out that to production, it's becoming very, very difficult to do that. So when you bring in that element of scale, um, when you bring in things like, you know, the requirements for service level agreements, I, I need to be able to, to uh, you know, to, to rely on this for production ready for my consumers or for my constituents, what have you. That, that's when things start to get really, really complex. So we're seeing a lot of cool examples like that, uh, again, across the globe. 